How is everybody doing? Let's, uh, let's do violent systems, huh? It's violent systems. So we're starting the stream. Well, uh, let's start telling everybody that the stream is live. Hope you're having a good day. Maybe we'll tell the Kinder Gym people. I feel like they should know, perhaps. Tell the Kinder Gym to pack it up, pack it in. I guess today we're gonna have uh, more commentators, not just me. First post, Pog got first post. Let's see video games. Hell yeah, video games. Heard y'all like video games. Some gamers. Uh, we got a packed set of uh, matches today. Let's see who we got on the agenda. So we're gonna have Quite a few people. We got Solar is going to take on Mint. Uh, Mint said he would do commentary as well. Uh, we got Pog in the chat. Shoutouts to Pog. Going to take on Vorbane again. Apparently this is a grudge match. The grudge match. Uh, Bellin is going to take on London. Uh, I am going to fight lunch today. My own coach. Uh, we are going to uh, see how my training's been going. Uh, it's important to square up with your coach here and again. Uh, and Zero is gonna take on Danny, AKA Jeff. Wow. You know, that's an important, that's a big claim. They should put Asuka Kazama in Tekken 8. Yeah. Sounds pretty good. I would, I would also like to see Wang. Yeah. Lord Wang Jinrei. Everybody is asking for Oscar. It's true. All right, all right. So who wants to go first? Um, Solar and Mint, are you here? You're first on the card. Oh my goodness. That Pikachu is eating some ramen. That is so cute. Hell yeah, Vorbane returns for violence. All right, Solar, you ready? And we got uh, Mint. Is Mint here? Uh, Mint is here. Beautiful. Let me invite y'all. Let me set up the uh, the card. Maybe I'll commentate this, and then uh, Mint can jump in commentary afterwards. Unless you want to live commentate your own match. Uh, let's set up the scoreboard. On this side, we got Lord Minter Galactic. Fighting out of wherever. Weighing in at he, him. And on this side, we got Comrade Solar fighting out of somewhere. Beautiful. All right, let's get you all invited. Private slots. Uh, let's invite y'all, huh? We got solar. Invited. We got mint. Invited. Score is zero to zero. I'm gonna set myself to auto skip. Heck yeah. I was watching Vorbane training. Vorbane has been training in the law cave. It is sick as hell. It's zero to zero, let's get it. Top of the morning, top of the morning. Yeah, 
Any feedback on the audio? How do we how do we sound? Okay, let's make sure I got the sides correct. My autotune seems to be off. Yeah. Okay, mint on the right. Rocking the Leo. Yeah, Mint, a uh, very generalist uh, player, deep roster for Mint. Uh, arguably a Leo main, although we've seen the uh, Quarong quite a bit. Zafina. Solar pretty much always going with Zafina. There's a, a purported Lydia Sobieska, although I've never seen her. Demon Paw. Leo's got a good demon paw. Ooh, squid punch whiffs, no, uh... Okay. Scarecrow pressure. Jabs out of it, though. Mint's hell sweeping. Tries to dab on her. Ooh, that was a frame trap. Shouldn't swing. Hell sweep, nice launch. Bump, bump, bump. Good combo. Yes. Ooh, whiff punish for the slap. Second hit. Mint looking really strong. Round two. Fight. Ooh, what's the Ford Ford for? That is a big move, but it's not infinitely big. Ooh. Down three. Into the Mantis pressure. Into the Scarecrow pressure. Oh! Chooses not to go for. This is very tense. Dancing in the mid-range. Wow! Solar goes for a down forward two for reasons I don't understand, but it works. Look at that wall combo. Big damage. She's got a safe push, because why? She needs it. Oh, into the pickup? Yeah, that's gonna hurt. Casters are ducking with the human pop. Demon Paw. Ooh! Bump, bump, bump. Falls out of the wall combo. Here comes Solar. Bump, bump. Oh! Leo turned to fall out of the wall combo. Wow! I heard this Leo character is pretty good. But it's not just Leo. You know who it is? It's Mint. Mint is pretty good. Mint now going to be on the left, taking first blood. Alright, we got a violent start for this uh, violent systems on this beautiful Friday. Yeah, Bajuquan Gaming. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get ready for the next battle. Game two. Here we go. I think both of these characters are in Tekken 8, I believe. Yeah, Leo's confirmed, right? And like, Zafina strongly suspected. Oh, he got out the pizza! He got out the pizza. Spacing. Ooh, Dab's on her! That was not a hit. He just did it. Back one forward pressure. Second hit. Blocks it, but no punish. On the 
Egyptian Pistons. That was a whiff punish. Beautiful. Bump, bump, bump. Okay. Wow! Solar finds another uh, down forward too. For reasons. Mint just like not blocking, apparently. He's still in the lead. Oh! Second hit. Man, that back one four is a pretty good string, huh? Stance dancing to the stanciest characters. <gasps> Just kind of swing in. Okay, guaranteed follow up. Nice. No punish on the uh, little bit slow. Uh, Leo's down for two is not safe. Wow. Okay, right under the slap. Second hit. Works every time. Mint falls out on the uh, wall combo. Nice punish. Bump, bump, bump. Pretty good wall. Uh, weird wall angle. Still actually quite winnable for Mint. That'll do it. Oh, he screwed it up. Oh my god. Silver clutched it out. Taking advantage of the um, slip up on Mint's part. Rare slip up. Second hit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, that's absolutely take what you can get. That's what that's what makes wins, right? Handling the scrambles. Okay, fishing with the uh, one plus two string. Nice little pick up there. Oh man, why does that down for a two hit? Solar is just fighting these, incredible. Squid punch from downtown. Nope. Yeah, Solar not quite sure what to do about that, um, what is that, QCF three plus four, whatever that is. <gasps> that was a draw. Right? Wasn't that- that round was a draw. Wow! Okay, finds the, um, the stance two. What is that? Bokoho two. Whoa, 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 Low pair on the house sweep! Oh, oh. Nice! Sidewall does not save mint there. Second hit. Okay, Min clutches it out. Game two. Nice work. These are... It's 2-0, but it's close. Still very winnable by Solar. Man, I'm so excited for Tekken 8. Obviously, I love Tekken 7, but I was watching the thing last night. It was... I'm so pumped. Looks great. Get ready. You want deathmatches back. That's fair. Yeah, yeah. I think it's interesting. Apparently, you can't rank down uh, below a certain level, like Warrior or something. I didn't get the exact details. Like, rank is one way up to a certain point. Oh, okay, costume change. Spacing, spacing. That was like five seconds with no buttons pressed. No buttons pressed even. Oh. Ooh, counter hit. Oh, oh. oh man. I think 
think the second hit's a high there, I think. No, hit confirm. Good punish. Get Leo out of there. Jack Frost is live. That's right, there's lore. Okay, this is still anybody's round. Like, one rage type would do it. Oh my god, Raw Chris Crow! Round two. Fight. Raw Cursed Crow, incredible! Oh yeah, Bellet, that's a good point. Yeah, they, um... Yeah, you used to have, like, uh, cues up to a certain point. Oh. Wow, okay, Solar found a rhythm here. That's gonna kill. If he doesn't screw it up, he doesn't. Solar takes a commanding lead in game three. Okay, Mint doesn't want to give this game up, though. Oh, no! She's out of there. Very slippery character. Just zooms away. Woo! Okay, slips a second hit. Mid's hell sweeping. Yeah, they used to have a whole. Oh. Mint's doing the low. Spacing, spacing. Man, I believe. Oh. Second hit. Okay, uh, small punish off the um, second hit of the hell sweep. Wow, okay. If Solar doesn't, oh. <gasps> American reset, oh, he's out of there. Oh, he screwed that up so now. Oh, oh, oh. The accidental back turned mantis. Nobody wants back turned mantis. Maybe maybe Solar had a set up there or something. That that looked like accidental. Second hit. Yes, yeah, Zafino is gonna zoom out of there, huh? Ooh. Yeah, Solar can absolutely still win this. In the lead, actually, still. Uh, rapidly dwindling. <gasps> Mint clutches it out. Incredible. No, 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 Solar, you got this. 100% winnable. We need a spirit bomb. Yeah, arms up. We got it. We're we're channeling our key or whatever. I actually don't really know anything about uh, animes and spirit bombs. Apologies. I'm the fakest. It's looking real strong there. Uh -huh. Get ready for the next battle. 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 All right. Same characters. Mint now on the right. Okay, switching to the Bibson. That's right. Round one. Fight. Zafina bringing up uh, really important questions about the nature of time and will. Oh, second hit is a high. Oh, 
Goal goes for the low end of the stance. Interrupts the hell sweep. Here comes Mint pressuring at the wall. Squid Punch, get out of there. She's just like you. Uh, doing a Squid Punch? Being at the wall? Having a pizza? Curious. Demon Paw. Wow, okay, counter hit on the back one four. Bump, 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 all the way to the wall. Bump, bump. Oh, no hit confirm, but also no punish. Bump, bump. All the way to the wall. Um, wow, nice squid punch. Oh no! Accidental back turn mantis again. Jumping. Wow! That was like 10 seconds of movement into that forward four. Incredible. Wow. Okay, it doesn't swing into the uh, KNK stance. Sec oh, first hit. Nice whiff punish. Mint was on it. Ready with that demon hog. Oh. Ready with the demon hog again. Good whiff punishes. Wow. Okay, that was a whiff punish too. Um, he might have... Let's say that was on reaction. I believe you can pick up off that. Hell sweep in. It's safe. Okay, um... Could have punished. A little bit slow on the punish. Wow! Nice! Slips the, uh... The high there. Alright. Yeah. I mean, looking strong. That's four. But... First four games are data, though. Solar's got another year. Deep breaths, you know? That is 100% right. Yeah, Pog, the hashtag lunch sweep. Lunch sweep. This is the solar sweep right now. Well, we can't, can't call it into existence until. Do sharp test. Yeehaw. Here comes the Fiener. Fight. That's right, yeah, comeback starts here. Down forward one. Nice, good, safe mid checks. Okay, not quite that punishable. Wow, okay, whiffs the, um, it's okay. That would have been bad if it was blocked. Hell sweeping. Oh, 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 oh. I don't think that. Okay. Mint takes first round, but. Mint 
No punish on the, um, on the down forward two, which is not safe for Safina. Hell sweep in. So many hell sweeps. Mint is playing Kazuya now. Perfect. Man. Round three. Fight. Yeah, the devil generic was to make, uh, make Mint go to hell sweeps. Okay. Uh, I, I don't think that's safe, but it's probably not 15. Leo experts can, uh, comeback starts here! That's right! Solar's got his back all the way against the wall. Uh, from a round perspective. Okay, that, I think that was a whip punish. Comeback starts here, let's go Solar! Spacing a little bit off. Um, gets that Scarecrow 1 plus 2. That's a safe mid poke. She needs it. It's actually a safe mid. The power crush. It's ridiculous. That was a whiff punish. Okay. Hop kick. Demon paw. Squid punch working out. Wow. Internet. Second hit. Nice punish. Oh my gosh! Try it again. The Egyptian, not cool. Second hit, okay. Goes to the mid. Counter hit, okay. Little combo though. Second hit, no hit, confirm. Oh my gosh! It's okay. Still in it. This is gonna kill. Bump, bump, yeah! Okay! First four games are data. This is your fate. Solar now on the left. The comeback starts here. Some, uh... battle, battle, battle. Yes, tele telepathically telling Solar to do. Um... I would, yeah, Squid Punch. I would say Ford, Ford, Ford. I'm not a Zafina expert by any means, but that's my uh, that's my entire game plan with Zafina. Squid Punch and a Hoppy Kick. She got the cowboy outfit, cowgirl outfit. Yeah, sticking with the Leo here. Uh, and Solar is locked into Zafina for the entire set now. He's got to make this comeback uh, four games in a row with Zafina, and that's a good way to start it. How can she slap? Ooh, gets cut by the second hit. Okay, squid punch. Okay, not that punishable. Second hit, still not that punishable. That's gonna kill if he doesn't screw it up. And he does not. Yeah, I love this stage. Mentally, I'm here. Sweep in. No hit confirm. Round three. Fight. Just uh, enjoying the music here. Second hit. Ooh! It's clipped by the shoulder on the wall standing four one two. Here comes Solar. Oh, wow! 
Uh, I don't think that was necessarily the punish. It might have been. Maybe he just forgot to block in stance. Goes for mid. Wow! Here comes Solar. He could kill here. Uh, not like that. Don't go back turn. Okay. Okay. Nice punish. Okay. Holy cow. Turn it up, turn it up. Okay, oh, a little bit slow in the punish, that's okay. Gets the low out of Scarecrow. Here comes mid, blocks the hell sweep, good punish. Great combo. Bump, bump. Okay. Okay, rolls forward into the hell sweep. Gets a back turn. Okay, it's set point for mint. It's set point for mint. So he needs to win this. No punish. Oh, no hit confirm. Uh, the dab did not hit. Oh man, so there's work in the uh, Zafina blender. Down three. Okay, oh, oh, oh. Hell sweep to take it. Okay, nice work. Nice work, Mint. So, Mint manages to uh, stop the comeback, but that was, was pretty good. Pretty good. Man. Fantastic first set. Uh, final score 5 to 1 in favor of Mintergalactic. Nice work. Um, it's the thing about hell sweeps. <laughs> Five one, but it, it's totally true. It's absolutely true. Okay, who's up next? And also, Mint, do you want to get on commentary? Mint, do you have the caster roll, or should I? Uh, okay. And also, who's up next? We've got, um, let's see here, who else? So, Pog versus Vorbane, are y'all here? Y'all are here, right? Should we do that one next? Pog versus Vorbane? Yeah, let's go, let's go. I'm inviting y'all. I'm gonna, uh, oh. is yes. Vorbane is yes. Y'all get in here. And uh, let's welcome... Welcome, Mint, uh, to the stream. Hello, Mint. How are you doing? How are you feeling about your uh, your victory? Hi. Um, I am feeling okay about it. There's definitely a lot of stuff that uh, Solar was starting to take advantage of towards the end there, like... Uh, Namely, the fact that I do not have the ability to block low. So, <laughs> I think that um, I kind of just sort of rushed to the end as fast as possible because I didn't want to eat any more split punches. Yeah, that's uh, totally reasonable. Yeah. In this corner. <laughs> wow, okay, Vorbean, cut into promo. He says, I've had enough of your perfidious Poggery, boyfriend. Holy shit. That's intense. I can't believe you said am that. I allowed to, am I allowed to swear on this? I, I think you can and should. Holy shit. <laughs> How are right. my uh, microphone levels doing, chat, by the way? Um, I've been uh, told in the past that um, my microphone audio is a little bit low, so if I need to turn it up, please let me know. This is good? Okay. Pretty good. Beautiful. All right, so in this corner we got out of, uh, fighting out of, oh, this is like a, a Canada match, isn't it? Vorbane's Canadian too, I believe. 
my auto tunes off. Oh shit, hold on a sec. Okay. Uh, I believe this is two Canadians. Pretty sure. Did, should I turn up mid? I can. I could make you louder. Um, I just boosted my internal uh, microphone okay. audio on the Windows taskbar. So. Okay. I see. But yeah, you can also uh, increase my voice in Discord too. That, to be totally honest, that might be a little bit. You might be a little bit too loud. If you could turn yourself down. Oh no! Pod okay. says you're perfect. 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 You know what I say to that? All right. That's cool. Yeah. So fighting out of uh, Vancouver, I want to say it's Vorbane. Let's fighting, go Vorbane. Fighting out of Winnipeg. The Pog boyfriend. Let's go Pog boyfriend. Let's go Pog boyfriend. Chat. Make some noise. Make it a noise. There you go. Let's Yay. see those woos. I wanna see I wanna see some Ric Flair in the chat. <laughs> Round one. Heck yeah, okay, if we're being on the left. Starting okay. off with the down two. Wow. I like to see those. Oh, he, Ooh. he thought about it. That, that was a setup uh -huh. I told him to do. He got, he got killed for it. Sorry. Uh, look, setups, if they were if there was a perfect setup, everybody would play that character. Yep. And also Tekken would not be any fun. Exactly. Very strong first round from Pog here. Definitely yeah. uh, playing on Vorbane's tendency to be a wild child. Yeah, although. OK, there he goes. Ooh. 3 plus 4, 4. The double-edged sword unsheathes itself. Oh! Let's go, the triple string. kicks. The flipple kicks. Shoutouts to simple flips. Oh, big down. What is that, one? Down. He backs yeah. away. The, the stance got him yeah. out of the way of the incoming. Incredible. Very nicely done from Gordon. Oh, that almost worked. He's So he's here he's looking for the... Um, the down two three uh, counter hit launch, uh, which worked there. There we go. Oh, she fell out. She fell out. Side throw. Mhm. Mm oh, another strong throw. I have no idea what the break on that is, by the way. That was uh, either the one or the two. I didn't see. Okay. I got hit by that like five times today. Yeah, she's real good at that. Yeah, <laughs> Buck is so good at throwing with this character. Nice. Yeah, he's a grappler. That's a strong, strong round so far. Uh oh. But it could turn around at any moment. Oh! Launched but killed for it. Very smart to trade there. Yes. Bug taking game one. Still very much anybody's game. Absolutely. See if you can find a rhythm uh, where he could like be fishing for the counter hits. Although... I feel like Pog is probably aware of the possibility that she might eat a down 2-3. Speaking from personal experience playing against Pog, I've had a lot of trouble dealing with her uh, turtling up when I try to go for counter hits, or at least in like the obvious spots. Like, um, if you can overload the mental stack, then you can counter hit anybody, but like, I have noticed that it is very difficult to like disrupt Pog's rhythm uh, once she really gets going. That's fair. She said she she says that this is impossible. In fact, mm -hmm. find a rhythm versus me. Yeah. Get ready for the it's impossible, battle, battle, battle. yeah. We hope TE lobbies have a dedicated spectator slot. You know that would be that'd be pretty good. I would like that as I would like that as well, yeah. I just hope they just hold like they're wholesale stealing everything else. Wait a second. Oh, she went oh. with the Okay, we got a Ogsika Kazama? Yeah, no, she switched characters on a win. Can't do that. Yeah. Oh, that's not allowed? Yeah, no, you can't can't do that. Um Okay. Pog? Well we gotta we gotta switch back to Dragon Off. Yeah, I can't do that. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I So we gotta get a judge's ruling on this. Just uh 
Yeah, maybe just like hold forward. Yeah, hold forward. Perfect. Oh yeah yeah yeah. No, it's it's okay. So just I guess yeah, we never just... really had like a. Uh, yeah 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 a yeah. Set, so we're being uh... just just uh just kill her as fast as you can, and then we'll go back to character select. In the future, maybe we should have like a, a rule page somewhere or something yeah. that people can reference. Yeah, Vorbane just think, uh, uh, jabber until. I don't think Vorbane is quite up to speed with what uh, what's going on yet. He's not listening to the to the commentary. No, he's not. Yeah. Oh, look at this sportsmanship. He he doesn't know. That he's supposed to take this. Yeah. So he's he's imagining that she has like a um a controller issue or something, yeah. Yeah. You love to see it. What a Chad. Absolutely, yeah. Not taking anything that he doesn't feel is uh warranted. Yeah. That's some uh that's some impressive key charging though. Yeah. Not many people can uh, hit all four buttons that fast like that. Yeah. Oh, there he goes. There he goes. Okay. All right. I think yeah, we're on the same page. That'll do it. Oh no! She accidentally teched the throne. <laughs> <laughs> okay. 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 Let's just call that uh, that match never happened. Right on. Yeah. Non it's uh, collectively collectively blank the last two minutes from your memory, please, chat. Yeah. 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 Yeah, that's uh, TWT rules. You know, you gotta gotta stick with the same character on a. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is a this is an official TWT event. Yeah, so points are on the line. Yeah, points are on the line. Man, I I think you could have maybe key charged a bit more in that match. Yes, I I don't have any TWT points, and I I would dearly like to have TWT points, but I keep not getting them. <laughs> I'm sorry. I know it's it's uh, it's unfortunate. Do you have to crack uh, top sixteen to be it, qualified? It, it depends on the size of the tournament. Gotcha. The key charge is the key charge. Yes, that's correct. Yeah. I wonder. Or if... the Greek the Greek letter key. Yes. Maybe Mel has TVT points. I don't know. Okay, back to Maybe. back to drag. Okay, it's one in the fight, yeah. Yeah, Vorbane says um, his uh, internet connection is not good enough to have the stream up at the same time. Yes. So I don't, I, I completely don't blame him for that. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Hey. Um, zero. Yes, in theory, KG could qualify as a TWT event, but we would need to uh, submit a bunch of forms and stuff, and I don't think Mel and Wish are going to be doing that. Also, we would need to use TWT rules. Yes, that is correct. Which, to be fair, I think we do. Uh, we don't. It's actually slightly different. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Um, we before you joined, we did do TWT rules, but um, afterwards, uh, we decided to make it uh, stage is always random versus uh, loser picks. I see. Yeah. Also, um, yeah. only grand finals is first to three. Mm, gotcha. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh, she doesn't know. There he is. Go oh, the one inch pods. Let's Look go. Okay, good with punish. Nice combo. Bump, bump, bump. A nice crouch cancel there. Mm -hmm. Oh, she really wants the whiff punish with the QCF1. Getting so much mileage out of the triple kicks there. Snake edge. Nice blocks. Should have kept blocking, but you know, that's something to lab. Or ducking, I mean. Yes. Okay, Vorbane definitely needs to get something started soon here. Yeah, he's, uh, I think he doesn't really understand the frame trap that he's in here, necessarily. No, yeah, it's a difficult, it's a difficult thing to get out of, to be sure. Perfect. Nice jab checks. Yeah. Okay, game two, uh, two Pog. Second game that counts. Pog now on Pog the boyfriend. left. 
Magic 4 was very good. Yes, the Magic 4 was very good. I agree. Let's all uh, pour out um, a bottle of uh, Colt 45 onto the ground for uh, Magic 4s and Tekken 8. Are they all gone? I believe they are all gone, yes. Wow. That's a huge yeah. change, actually. It is, yeah. That and um, low parries and get up kicks, I think, are like the three biggest universal changes besides, mm. you know, the, the heat system existing, but. Yeah. You know. Dragonov has a mundane, mundane for. for. <laughs> so that's really interesting for characters like uh, Law, you know? Like, that's. Yeah, a big it kind of completely game. changes. Yeah, it kind of completely changes how his. Um, uh, structure is really like augmented and stuff like that. That's like one of the most important things about uh... As far as the keep out goes, his um, new nunchuck move seems like it could be really powerful for that, but time will tell mm, you know? Yeah. That's like his um, that's what makes like Law versus Kazuya good for Law is like mm -hmm. he can mostly shut down wave dash mix ups with, uh, with Magic yeah. 4. Um, that is a good point in the chat. Um, they're not gone because they'll still get people off you, but they're much lower payoff. Yeah, so um, instead of popping up for a launch, basically what they'll do is they'll um, knock you on your ass, basically. Okay. So it's still like a big, it's still like a big meaty hit, but it's not like um, you're at like big advantage, but you don't get like a combo off of it or anything. I see. Ooh, that okay, was an that's... interesting interaction. I actually like that change. That's that's pretty good. Mm -hmm. Ooh, finds it down two three. Nice. Hell yeah, R I P. Backsway. <laughs> oh, gotta have room behind you to backsway. Come on. Oh, nice kicks. Yeah. Hog definitely doing a good job of exploiting uh, Vorbane's blind spots here. Okay, just nice. delaying the tick throw. Oh, big round start. Down two. Man, okay. Getting those jab, che jab checks just all day. So if if he thinks that she's gonna jab check twice, then a down two three would actually be a really good idea. Yeah, something that um, something that high crushes early or just you know ducking, because um, if Dragonov is jab checking you, then chances are down two is coming out in the near future. Yes. Or throw. Good pressure. Good pressure so far here from Hog, looking very confident. Second hit. Nice. Nice. Just pokes him down. Yep, a clean 3 0. Pog definitely looking confident today. Was playing um, pretty confidently when um, we played earlier, too. So, uh, Pog, Danny, and I uh, did like a little lobby to uh, warm mm -hmm. up before the game. And, um, I mean, I got my ass kicked, obviously, but. Um, Pog was uh, playing um, very, uh, very aggressively, and um, honestly, uh, it paid off then, and um, I think that uh, it's paying off now too. Yeah. The cowboy fit is immaculate. I agree. That's um, Rising Zan Samurai Gunman. Quite a few uh, cowboy enthusiasts here in Kinder Gym. Mm -hmm. We saw the um, Cowboys of Fina last set. Cowboys of Fina. Cowboy Law, um, I believe. Uh, Somebody has a Cowboy Miguel. Yeah, I don't remember who off the top of my head. Uh, uh, Vaquero. Naz perhaps. Naz has a Cowboy Cowboy Paul. Off the top of my head. Ooh. We have an outfit for Bellet. Let's see this outfit. Dedicated outfits. Let's go. Wow. We'd love to see it. He's got the Tekken girls flag. Gotta rep the ladies. What an ally. One of my favorite genders. Mm -hmm. Dragonov. Mine too. Yeah. <laughs> Dragonov is also one of your oh! favorite genders. Yeah. yeah. Nice shoulder there. Getting oh. up to the wall. Honestly, Hog is doing so good with this wall pressure here. Round two. Well, standing one plus two at the wall. Mm -hmm. oh. It's such a good, it's such a good move. I get hit by it all the time. I mean, obviously it's like punishable, but yeah, that, that just means that just means you don't have to like, just don't block it. Yeah, don't let him block it. Okay, what's... Yeah, don't let him block it. Oh, frame trapped. Mm -hmm. Nice. 
Vorbane looking a bit unsure how to get out of this pressure here. Yeah, Vorbane definitely needs to uh, go into the lab and figure out um, what to do about um, Dragonov uh, jab checking in your face into uh, down down two. Starting the ten string. Mm -hmm. Oh, big trade. Effectively Oof. resets neutral here. Brutal. Finds the um, QCF1 uh, with punish. And that's it for game four. Nice work, Pod. The ladies, the ladies looking happy. <laughs> they love it. First they four games it. are data. First four games are data. We are in the front seats for to witness of for Vorbane, Vorbane Sweep. sweep. Vorbane, hashtag Vorbane Sweep. Type it up, put it on uh, X, put it on Mastodon, put it on Co-host, put it on uh, Blue Sky. Friends Hashtag are... Vorbane Sweep. Yeah. Your IRC that last channels. One that you said. Yeah, put it on IRC. Put it on uh, Twitch Rivals. Get out your CB radio. <laughs> Breaker Breaker. Hashtag Vorbane Sweep. And hell, post it in the Twitch chat. Wow. Hog boyfriend says whoops in all caps. Miss press. Uh oh. Oh, oh no. no. Are we Oscar again? Are we gonna see Oscar Kazammer? Is is Pog? No. Oh okay. no. Just pick the just pick the wrong costume probably. Okay. No no no. We're good. We're good. Okay. This one is canonical. Judge. Oh, they picked. Oh, stage. they picked the stage. Is that all? Should we, uh... I, I think we can let it rock. Unless, okay. um, unless we're being... Oh! Okay. Yeah, we're not, we're letting Look at this sportsmanship. Look at this sportsmanship. Yeah. Issue a game loss. Wow. Bellet, Bellet wants harsh Issue judgment. a game loss. A game Damn. loss. Damn. Wow. Round two. Fight. Um... The disrespect, the, the continuous uh, key charging. No, it's um, this is yeah. this is actually the the height of sports pe uh, sports ladyship. Yeah, but um, no, uh, Pog won, but uh, due to the way that the lobby system worked, was uh, up for uh, the uh, stage pick again and uh, pressed the uh, button. So. All right, Noogie to take it. Just blatant lack of sportsmanship from Pog Boyfriend. <laughs> Judges are throwing a red card onto the field. Uh. Went to Drick Wathar. Or. Wata? Wata. Wata bottle. Unclear. Your elbow hit the button. Okay. Excuses. Where no, man this has is. To trouble we gotta archive to this on. Credit. Archive on what? YouTube. I mean, this will live on forever, YouTube? right? Oh yeah, yeah. No, absolutely. Make it. Make Get it on the wiki. Eyes. Yeah. Yeah. Public display. Hanging in the MoMA. Absolutely. So, Vorbane on the left for that uh, god match that just happened. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is the closest 4 0 of all time. Have you ever had a triple perfect? Uh, or, no. Or triple? Never on purpose, no. Maybe like once against like one of my like IRL friends who like has literally no idea what they're doing. <clears throat> And just to be like, haha, I know this game and you don't, that sort of thing. But like, never in like a real match against another Tekken player. Never, no. Oh, oh, the 4 4 into the, um, into the wall standing, um. <laughs> 21 golden letters. Yeah. No golden Ooh, letters right here. Good mid check. Wow, heck of a step there. Vorbane is going to lay down the wall. Just round start nice. step into the down forward, too. Working out great. 
Doing such a good job of um, setting up Oki off of the wall combo. Pretty good float there. Off the uh, nice. big flip kick. Dick jabbing to make sure that we don't see the perfect. Very smart. Yeah. That is a moral victory. Oh. Okay. Nice. Big oh, launch. I Let's pee. go. Hey. I remember like oh. when I started playing like a year ago, Vorbane could not do a single combo, and now he is an unstoppable monster. Absolutely. Look at this. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. He's definitely had a major glow up since Kinder Jump started, and I am very proud of him. Unironically. There's the round. Yeah. There we go. Let's see those hands. Fight. Okay. It's actually a safe mid hook. The. Uh... Mm hmm. Wow. Oh, she got the ball too off the. Um... Very smart nap matchup knowledge. Most people in Kinder Jump see? don't uh, handle that string correctly. Ooh. Blocks the low but doesn't punish. Don't you? Gotta at least do your 11 frame. Okay, Pog takes it, but uh, nice work. Seeing, yeah, seeing a lot of um, fundamental building blocks here from Vorbane in that last match. Definitely, if I think if he had another five games to really just like soak in the matchup, I think we could definitely see a couple of wins in there. For sure. Yeah. Um. Mm. Yeah, he, he needs to work on um just dealing with kind of like. Yeah. Jab checks and jab check into tick throw and it's a difficult thing to deal with, honestly. Like that's yeah. part of the reason why I do it so much myself, because at the lower levels, jab check is just so effective. Absolutely. Okay, so that was um Yeah, yeah, yeah. Vorbin, that's uh that's all mm -hmm. for now. Yeah. So that's the end of the set. But yeah. super GG. So we got um Yeah, yeah, yeah. So Zero and Jeff. Let me invite them. Uh, yes. Or Danny. Danny, why are you Jeff, called? Why are you called AKA Jeff? AKA Danny. Because his name Jeff. His name is Jeff. His name Jeff. Yeah. I see. Uh, and then zero. Let's get. Uh, I have zero. no idea what I have no idea what Danny's actual name is. His name Jeff. <laughs> If if you're not in if you're not in the know, it's um it's an old uh, meme from a, a TV show or a movie or something. I, I don't remember what exactly. Right on. So yeah, I uh I will be right back. I will let you commentate this. Uh, for okay. A second, but I'll be back for uh, just a moment. Sounds good. Uh, well, first I'm gonna set the K, okay. and then zero with the V ver. Mm -hmm. Reset score. Zero, did you get the, um, you got the invite, right? None of those are your names. Okay, so you're, it's not your, okay. Your name is not Danny or Jeff. Danny is an international man of mystery. It's, yeah, he's mysterious as AF. That's, uh, okay, I'll Very be right. mysterious. Right. Okay. Zero to zero. Sounds good. Uh, don't say anything terrible. I'm sure you won't. I will, I will try not. Okay, holding down the fort here. Lags like crazy when you type it. Yeah, the um, text box has never worked properly for me in this game the entire time. Your real name is not actually Pog Boyfriend? Wow. My uh, perception of reality has been shattered, if I'm being completely honest. Okay, we got a clean slate here. Our third title match of the evening is starting up. We got Josie Rizal versus Paul Phoenix. Paul, probably one of Danny's uh, stronger mains out of the uh, 12 that he listed as his mains. Oh, very strong start here. Danny doing a lot of uh, sidestepping here. Very, uh, very three-dimensional player. Very nice down forward, too. 
Connects to the wall. Tries to go for the switch stance mix up. Doesn't fall for it though. Blastoise says, watch out for the Josie switch stance. I couldn't agree more. And the down forward one takes the first round. I almost called it a game. Oh. Throwing out those down forward twos, but thankfully they are safe on Paul. Paul at the wall, absolutely terrifying. I could not agree more. All right, I'm back. Nice swift punish. Hey, welcome back. Thank you. You uh, okay. only missed. Uh, you only missed one round. Okay. Very strong down forward two gets the launch. Probably going to the wall. Oh, not quite. Ooh, second hit. But the follow up string finishes off. Round three. Danny on the right. Mm-hmm. If that's his real name. <laughs> we may never know. Oh, nice switch stance shenanigans. Good job with the counter hit. Doesn't quite get the full pickup, though. Oh, oh gets a little punish on the... Um, I think he can back one to that, I believe. I am not 100% sure. I don't know Josie or Paul that well. I don't see either of these characters that much, if I'm being completely honest. She has an unsafe down forward, too. Does uh, she? But it launches Croucher's, yeah. Oh, gotcha. Okay. It's like it's a dragon off one, basically. Okay, is that like a generic minus 13 stop? One, uh, 12 or 13, one of those. Okay, gotcha. Leo's got the same thing. Ooh! Ooh! Death big is death punish. With the Oh my god, liver of health. The blue sparks Good execution grief. god. I was absolutely sure that he would kill. Danny it's takes minus game 12. One. Okay, thank you. Yep, Danny taking game one. But Zero has the heart of a champion. And we know V's got another gear. And first game is data. Absolutely. Absolutely. First game is data. I have definitely seen Zero come back from bigger losses than that. Absolutely. So this is an international uh, match. This is yet another Canadian, actually, fighting. Uh, yeah, uh, Danny is uh, Canadian. I don't know uh, around where, though. My understanding is the Toronto area. Yeah, it's uh, it's it's all just north to me, honestly. I have no idea what <laughs> Toronto is in relation to Quebec or like Winnipeg or any of that. One of, one of those fern places. I am a yeah, I am a typical I'm a typical ignorant American who has it's no a, idea what a province is. It's in a, it's in a different country. It kind of doesn't. If you if you tell me about a measurement and it's not like imperial, I just like start getting really mad and I like start like throwing things in close proximity to me. That's fair. I mean, mm -hmm. you know, as is as is my American right to do so. Yeah, I mean, I've actually got two bald eagles sitting on my shoulders right now, <laughs> one, one on each. That is inspiring. Yeah. Ooh, we've got the uh, we've got the Super Saiyan outfit. Yeah, I like oh, that. Oh, down forward two, looking crispy. It's the Danny is so competent with those down forward twos as like spacing tools. They're quite wow. He slipped. I the, get um... launched. I get launched so much by that. It's a good move. Mm. Oh, big kick. hop kick. This. Uh, okay. No blue sparks. I don't know if the blue sparks would have killed. It's not that much more damage, but yeah, it's it's minimal, but it is the, it is there. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Ooh. Finds a QCF one. That's a good move too. Absolutely. Yeah. Paul has got just a ton of really solid options for like most situations. Good character. You know, she can hurt him pretty bad for that. Um, I think she absolutely. can get the forward one plus two. Uh, is Josie? Pun yeah. Punish she's probably looking for. Um, That's a uh, back one one, if I remember. It is. Okay. Zero looking a little bit unsure how to deal with these death fists. <laughs> I'm not 100% sure either, so. If, oh no! Uh, if V figures out, then I, I will I will follow suit. Oh, what a hell sweep! Round three. Fight. Does Paul hop kick similarly dodge high like Josie's? Um, I don't know. It looks a little scrunchy, but um, I don't know. Maybe. What a wall carry! Wow. Oh. So Zero here is looking for the uh, Punch Parry. Um... Definitely, yeah. Uh, trying to call out um, something. I'm wondering if the intention here is to Punch Parry the Death Fist, maybe? 
That would be reason because it's a rate punch. I think her yeah. punch parry is specifically against rate punch. It, yeah, it is a it is on a specific side. I don't remember which side though. It catches electric. Nice, very nice. Oh, that's oh wow. That's like the deadest you can be. Yeah. A clean that's, hit. That's why Josie's soul just ascended to the afterlife in front of our eyes. Wow. It catches the two, so uh, right side. Okay, gotcha. Yeah, no, I, I got what you're. I got what you're trying to say, Pog. Yeah. So it's a. Uh, it is a right punch parry, confirmed by chat. So it must be true. Mm -hmm. No, I've, I've definitely had it um, catch my electrics before. So. Yeah, and electric is also on it too, so that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah. It's very embarrassing when. Uh... <laughs> when you get your electric punch parried. It it happens. Everybody gets parried sometimes. I got um I was playing um uh Leo against uh Geese against uh Danny, actually, and I got um I, I tried to run up and uh close the space because I was at a life deficit and the round was almost over, so I ran up and uh, demon pod and I got um I got predictable. Oh no. Mm-hmm. He, was he in max mode and he said predictable? No, it was just um, it was just the generic version. But I, I was I I felt I felt it. Yeah, he meant predictable. <laughs> yep. Wow! Shoutouts to Pog. Pog is now poiple. Shoutouts to Purple Boyfriend. Round one. Let's Impressive. freaking go! Wow. This is a nice outfit. It is in um. It overlaps with a mod that I used to have installed, but I installed it for uh, purposes of this tournament. Hmm. Who among us? Yep. Ooh. Nice down there, too. Kind of reminds me of um, Sakura, actually, a little bit. I, th I think that's the intention. Gotcha. Okay. Good one, Sun too. Sunburn Sakura, particularly. With the power of Satsui no Hado. Uh huh. Yeah, it's um, evil Sakura. Round two. Not to say that um, tan people are evil, but the Satsui no Hado makes you look like that you just got uh, out of a four hour standing booth session. Yes. As we all know. It's a common side effect of. Um... Mm. Wow, what a whiff punish! Very nice. Yeah. So Zero just stuck out the Ford 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 there, or uh, whatever that was. I don't. Yeah, I don't know. Ooh, connects with the big counter hit launcher. Danny getting so much use out of his launcher tools this uh, this game. Oh, yeah, throws one. it out. Just tries to go for it. Zero oh, no. definitely. Oh, I was gonna say zero making some good process progress in whittling down, but not quite able to finish the sentence. There's a whiff punish. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, down four has been unlocked. <laughs> what a good move. It's Ooh, quite well, there we go. There we go. We're seeing the uh we're seeing the uh, crouch dash follow-ups. Oh, that'll kill. Nice. One thing that would help Zero a lot would be using the mid out of switch stance move, defaulting to high too often, says Pog. Um yeah, uh I think that, that is uh I think that, that is a fair assessment. Absolutely. Yeah, I um, think um, Danny has shown that um, he is uh, ready and willing to duck anything that uh, Josie is throwing out. Oh my god! Yep. Besides what in the goddamn? <laughs> Tell you what. Uh huh. Ooh. But um, ooh, what a nice launch. Yeah. Um, get that CD two. Not able to finish the plate though, unfortunate. Gets smacked to the ground. Strongest oh, he, in the universe. He really is. He's in peak condition. Did you watch that um, footage from? Uh, I think it was yesterday where they revealed Panda and they showed off like a bunch of gameplay features, like the ghost battle and stuff. Yeah, I was watching that. Yeah, um, I thought it was really funny because Paul has like a string where he's got like a new voice line for it. I think it might be like one of his uh, sweeps or something where he just shouts out like. 
I'll kick your ass. And he did it like ah. five and he did it like five times during that gameplay demonstration. And I just bust out laughing every time. Uh, it. It's this it's the little things like that that we enjoy. Yeah. I mean so... As a tournament winning Josie expert, what adjustments would you make? Mm. I would uh I would start saying I'll kick your ass more. That's what I would do. <laughs> I'm sorry, you were gonna say something? You know, there's not a whole lot of um, prose that, um, or like full sentences mm. that Tekken characters say mid-match. That I think, is true. I, I feel like that's more of like an anime game kind of a thing where they... Oh yeah, absolutely. Are, Blaze Blue is full of those. Or uh, Marvel. Yeah, Marvel's got a lot of them too. Very talkative. Yeah, just look at um, Nova. That's my favorite example. Yeah, um... Energy Javelin. Gotta say it. Gotta say it. You like that? Energy Javelin. Yeah, I. it's actually a thing I don't love about Marvel, among other things. <laughs> there's, there's quite a lot to love and hate about Marvel. Oh gosh, I'm getting nervous. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, okay. oh, see, yeah, there's those ducks again. Yeah, that's what uh, that's what we were talking about a bit earlier. So I think he's playing the switch mix up quite well. Um, oh yeah, he's no, not like absolutely. pressing into it. Uh, yeah, um, just... Danny definitely seems like he is familiar with the Josie matchup. Yeah. Like I am seeing a lot of uh, I am seeing a lot of interactions that um, are studied and. Um, uh, intentional and purposeful is what I'm trying to say. Yeah. He plays Josie. Yeah. Well, I mean, he plays like the entire roster. So. Shout out to nice. uh, fellow Mokujins. Yeah. Shout out. Shouts out to Mokujin. There's a few of us in the in the community. That's that's the kind of player that I'm trying to be. Yeah. Well, you are in a. Uh, you know, there's you and Bellet and a. Uh, Mm. I guess Wish to an extent. Yeah. I think Wish just has like a core stable of characters. Nice sweep, by the way. Round three. Fight. Oh, Warbongo's coming out. Yeah. I, I definitely feel like um, Danny is feeling more and more comfortable whiffing the uh, big launchers because um, I think he's uh, sort of recognized the pattern of um, Zero just not... Um, either having like the cognizance or the uh, reaction speed to uh, really like uh, whiff punish them. So yeah. I think that um, he is definitely playing just like, ooh, what a low parry. Was just a playing parry. a lot more uh, Devil May Care than uh, he would otherwise, I think. Confidence in a pause, that's gonna be dead. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Does he know the combo? Let's find out. Yeah. Yes, yes, he does. <laughs> wow. All right. I, what we and saw the backflip. One other thing we saw that's <laughs> very uh, studied is um, he did the 13 frame punish against mm -hmm. the hatchet kick. Yeah, which you know that's that's not something you're gonna do unless, unless you, you know. know that that's a minus 13 move, yep. which is probably the most obvious thing that I've ever said on camera. Well, technically I'm on, in front of a microphone on a camera. Yes. Yeah. Warcrime DF2. I agree. Yeah. Um, it's real good. Two, two, three weeks ago, before I really had a, a lot of Paul, like, Paul experience, before I played like Naz Paul and Danny Paul, like, oh, he's got a good Paul within too. 40, within 48 hours of each other, like, I would have not have said that, like, Paul has one of the best DF2s in the game. Now, I think Paul has one of the best DF2s in the game. He really does. Mm hmm. Him and uh, Leos is really good. Uh, who else is this really good? Well, they serve different purposes. No, yeah, they do. They do. His almost like almost uh, high crushes in a few places. Yeah. And it's like uh, like uh, Pog said. Yeah, it's basically a homing move. <laughs> Noctis is the DF two character. Yeah. Well, yeah. Noctis <gasps> is the obvious answer. 
for best DF2 in the game. I think in terms of like raw range and damage, that is definitely true. Oh, oh that one's high. But it really depends on like what you're really looking for out of a DF2. But uh, enough talking about that. There's a match going Yeah, on. there's no Noctis on the screen here. Thankfully. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> wow! And a perfect, holy moly. Nice mix. At, at least four golden letters. Going for the switch. Our, 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 oh, oh, the charge up. That was really close to it. Just like a little bit slow on the whiff punish. Nice launch. What cognizance, really? Safe death fist. Why does he have the safe one? He needs it. <laughs> he needs it. Death fist being a heat engager is actually fucking me up. Oh, good duck. I'm so but, excited. Uh, oh, completes a string. Nice, good string completion. Very good, um, very good recognition that um, he hasn't been um, responding to the uh, completed string. Oh, gets a nice push kick. Oh, wow. There we go. Zero turning the tables. First four games. Saying, hey, oh. I have a DF2 as well. Yeesh. Oof. We we'll get to see the full uh, combo kick. God. Wow. Oh, what a, no blue sparks. what a ridiculous character. No blue sparks. Oh. Does, it, does it really count? It doesn't. No. Got to do it again. I wasn't watching. But nice job from Zero using the uh, forward one plus two. I want to say that was. Ah. I I looked. I started playing Josie for 24 hours, and now I kind of know what some of them moves are. Yeah, that's the forward one plus two. Um, the okay. big leaping elbow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a really strong move. Quite good. Oh! Yeah. oh. Walks around. Dang, oh, so hurt. The sidewalk. Wow! <laughs> nice throw. Yeah, V can totally... Okay. Oh, big jab here. One more positive. Yep, family. there we go. Zero's on the board. Zero sweep. Hashtag zero sweep. Yeah. Wow. Josie Gaming. Big Josie Gaming. Josie Rizal. The calm before the storm. <laughs> yeah. I'll tell you folks at home, anybody watching this, the hardest part of being a TO is figuring out stuff to talk about during the downtime between the games, especially in Tekken, because you have literally a minimum of 60 seconds <laughs> between a game ending and a new game starting. And you do not realize how long 60 seconds is until you have unbroken silence during it. Mm. Josie Resolve is a type of name. It sounds like you should have a subtitle, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. So we'll find out, ooh, he's got the ninja costume now. Fight. There we go. Push kick into the plus frames, ooh. Keeping it safe. I love this costume specifically on Paul because it absolutely looks like he bought it from a Spirit Halloween. <laughs> He's really a very sneaky guy, you know? He is. He kind really of, um... Is. I feel like this costume might have to be illegal because it's just too hard to see him. That's fair. Oh, nice side. Malk, I believe. Oos. Wait, did they? Solar, is that true? I don't, uh, like, I don't Ooh. not believe that, because it not she just, like, blatantly named after, like, one of their national their, heroes? Their official national like, hero, yeah, Jose Rizal. Yeah, Jose Rizal, and they just was like, she's nothing, she's nothing like him, and doesn't even look like him, they're just, like, named similarly? I, I suppose, um... I heard that they can like uh, had a discussion with Markman about that character design, who is you know Filipino American. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just think it's kind of funny, like not 
I can't really speak from the perspective of a Filipino because I am not one. Yes. But um, it's kind of like um, coming into like America and like doing like ten seconds of research and just coming up with like a random character who is like just wow what completely unremarkable. Imagine. Very nice, by the way. And just calling them like Georgina Washington or something. I would be a hundred percent down for Georgina Washington. Yeah, yeah, think... absolutely. Oh no! Who's oh, gonna... Danny's gonna do something. Wow. Oh, timer scam. Zero takes it there. Hmm. Oh, nice string follow up. Wow. wow. Zero definitely getting more unpredictable here, which is a good thing to do. Yeah. Especially this towel. late into a set. You absolutely have to change up your tactics this late into a set. Nice sidewalk. Finds a demo man. Mm hmm. Yeah. Got a whip punish there. Uh, Jabs into the demo man. Oh! Demo man's so strong. Two down three. Four. You don't see, like, a single jab into low all that often, but when a character has such a thing. Wow! Oh! Yeah. Wow. Okay. Good so block on the demo man. Guy. It was just it was just a, a one guy syndrome. When when some guy says a thing, did he say That's it on Twitter? True. Yeah, if it, it was, was on Twitter, it has to be true. Yeah, they've got fact checkers. I heard. Certified one guy moment. Wow. Slash kick with trying trying so hard to really just like close in on Danny's effective range. Nice, nice follow up. Doing a Question. good job of recognizing um, what strings he are. He walked um, all the way around the switch switch yeah. one. <laughs> it's, it's crazy. Right, and the Danny homing takes move it. takes it. Honestly, uh, we were seeing some really solid adaptation from Zero, but um, it was just unfortunately not quite enough time to take it. Yeah. Really strong. Which is why. <laughs> he should be first to tens, obviously. <laughs> we got to do it. Run the first to ten uh, on stream. I am not. I am not running a first to ten. Commentate the what, first to especially, ten. Especially, one that starts at eight p.m. Eastern. Commentate the five different sets of. Uh, oh my god, Chivas. Okay. Imagine so watching fifty games of Tekken potentially, or more than that. Agreed. Exactly. Yeah. At least fifty. Okay, so yeah. we got, who do we got next? Uh, so we had, we have not yet had uh, me and Pog, or me and, uh, and Lunch, and we have not yet had Bellet versus London, so who's ready? Is uh, Lunch uh, present and accounted for? Okay, well, if Coach is not ready, then... 95 potentially, yeah. It's rough. Quick maths. Quick uh, maths. London, are you here? Bellet, are you here? Uh, London is here, and Bellet is also here. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> My ability to say, like, one-syllable names for people is not there, unfortunately. Names of, you know, non-animate nouns. Listen, listen. Vorbane is... Kinder Jim's mascot. You don't mess with a mascot. You don't mess with a precious intellectual property like that. Oh, lunch is online. Okay. I think lunch is warming up. Okay. All right. We got Bellet. And we got. Uh, Bellet's going to take on London. Mm -hmm. AKA Yume Nike. London, London, London. As she's known in most circles. She's been known too. Mm -hmm. Pog, you can be the pop star of Kinder Gym, yes. Going up against... Uh, Pog, right? Going up against Pog. No, Pog already played. No. Gosh, uh, Pog played against Bellet. Orbane. There's a lot of people. Okay. <laughs> I'm We're sorry, I should, be doing, I should be doing more to help here. No, no, no. It's, I, I don't see what you could be. There's a lot of people with, um, with names. Everybody's got one. That's what I've heard. 
They really do. Yeah. At I'm least two. Bit, I'm a little bit out of it, to be totally honest. I need gotcha. to, like, breathe some deep breaths and drink more water. If you need to uh, step away, I can manage on my own. The score won't be uh, updated, but uh, no, I don't know. talk through it. We're good. We're good. Okay. We got London. And we got Bellet. We do have both of those people in this lobby. We have my dog telling me that he wants a french fry Are you gonna that is on my desk. I am going to give it to him. Yes! Dog gets a french buddy? fry. Like, there you go. Your dreams can come true. You could be your a Your dreams gamer. can come true. Get that french fry, dog. Yep. What's the dog doing? Eating a french fry? Eating a french fry. It's just that simple. That's beautiful. I hope to also eat a french fry soon. Oh, god Sam. I got like three-fourths done with the disgusting fast food that I picked up because there was a 45-minute interval between me getting <gasps> off work and me getting on this stream. That's fantastic. <laughs> Yo. All right. So, wow. The we have a internecine mirror. Ling Nation. Ling Nation has attacked. All peace, you know, has. Wow. This is what we call a Captain America Civil War. We do call it that. Yeah. Wow. Down back twos. Okay. Uh, so London in the red, uh, red and black. Gosh, that, she needs it. That down back one that goes mm -hmm. back turned. Woo, back turn sweep. Very strong uh, poking here from uh, both players. Wow. I'm seeing like a pretty good amount of whiffs and whiff punishes from both sides right now. I think um, this is just gonna be one of those kinds of first to fives. Yeah. They, they don't nice. call it peaceful systems. <laughs> it's true. If you want violence, you're gonna get it. This may be the most violent, violent systems match of the evening. Oof. Nice block. No punish, though. What is that? Uh, minus, like, it's launchable, right? Uh, sorry, which move? The back turn, the three. The yeah, launching it's, it's up, launch, launching, launching up kick, yes. yeah. Uh, mistrust. Uh, yeah, that's, yeah, that's right. Mistrust. Nobody launches it, though. I know, right? But they should. Yeah. Wow! Well, nicely done. Yeesh. The tilt and tumble. Slips the incoming. Getting Hot a lot of use it. out of the uh, back turn sweep there. We're seeing... I, I do believe... I may have to get out my certification glasses, but I do believe we are seeing actual factual shenanigans taking place right now. Yeah. Well, in a link mirror, you know. Mm -hmm. What are you gonna... It's a common occurrence. Wow! Oh, the what drive. a rage drive! Spike and the catches the four. get up. Round four. Very smart. Very, very good mindfulness. Yeah. From so, uh, Bellet there. <laughs> just there the you go. Two ones. Yep. <laughs> yep. God, this is like this is like a Lee mirror where they just keep trying to mistrap each other to see who can do <gasps> it first. Q fist. Nice. Oh no! Raw back Ooh. turned into the um into the rage drive. Unsealed the low launcher. I don't think I've ever <gasps> successfully blocked Ling's rage drive. You you have to predict it basically. You really do. It's a preemptive type thing because it's not seeable. It's just the threat of it being there is so great that she gets away with so many mids. Yeah. Bella wow. taking the first game. London definitely is going to be utilizing that first game as data, though. If I know anything about London, it is that she is very good at absorbing data like a sponge and then wringing it out when it absolutely needs to be ha to happen. Yeah, see what kind of um, reads she's able to file away for later. Absolutely. That gets locked up in the mental vault. In her mind palace. Mm-hmm. 
the Deep. BBC Sherlock Mind Palace. Wow. Yup. You yep. have to assume she's gonna let her rip whenever she's back turn in neutral. Yeah. It is honestly, very, very you are you are you are honestly more right than not about that. Yup. Like down back two. I wonder if she's gonna. But then, but then, once you know, you know that they think. Mm -hmm. Well, Ling has trouble closing the gap when it's um when she's back turned anyways. So. Nice, That's sweet. Her. The reverse ivory cutter. Ooh, big, big palm. Ooh, goes for the mid high string out of. Mm -hmm. Wow. Good love. You know, Bellet has been playing so much. She's she's just constantly practicing. Yeah, absolutely. I was uh, playing Bellet the other day, and I was just like watching just randomly what what like everything that was going on and i was just like man you've been uh, putting in the work she really it's has. it's it's honestly it's honestly very apparent when someone is putting in the work nice perfect by the way from uh London yeah Ford. speaking of putting commentator in the work. commentator's curse at its finest <laughs> let's talk about how strong she is as she gets uh, yeah exactly 28 golden letters uh, yeah the best the best way to at least 95 golden letters but um, the best way to cause someone to lose a set is to start talking them up. How, how great they are. Wow. <laughs> yep. I don't know why. Hmm. Good adjustment this round from uh, Bellet, though. Wow. Definitely um, playing outside of London's effective range, making her come in and just walking, uh, ab abusing the linearity in her approach tools. But you know what's not linear? Snake Edge. Snake Edge. Oh no! Don't, there not, it don't is. take that not a request. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the palm! Another set of golden letters. The amount of which is indeterminable. Our best, ma best mathematicians are working on the problem. We need micrometers to measure these letters. Oh, nice get up. Combinatorics experts are number theorists, sir. <laughs> Trying to quantify how many. It is intricately linked with Fermat's last theorem. Wow. Nice trade there. Oh my gosh. Oh, mistrust. This is a very, Good. very close game. Oh, nice no. Nice wall carry. Oh, calls out the getup option. Oh my god. Does she have a time this? She does. Good grief. Oh, wow. London's got to be. London's got to be kicking herself about that fail pickup. Wow. I know she is. It's okay, Lennon. You got this. It's still anybody's game here. 100%. That was so close. Mm hmm. Link's just got like a weird, a weird girl body. It's hard to pick up. Mm. Mm. First two games of data. That's so true. Yeah. That is actually factually correct. So I wonder if Bellet is um, dedicated to running the Ling Mirror here today. Like, mm -hmm. say if she drops a game, uh, which is, do you think we'll see Panda? You know, we could. I don't think. I don't think so. I think. I think Bellet's committing. She's got quite a few other characters. Yeah. We might, we could see the Josie. We could see we could. Um, yeah. Armor King. It's possible. Uh, or Panda. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Panda did just get a statue unveiling, you know? Yeah, topical. I, yeah, you know, everybody's, everybody's favorite Tekken character, Panda. We are... <laughs> everybody's pumped about bears. Everybody's pumped about Panda! More, the more bears. What a whiff punish. EAP, pumped about panda. Get it get it trending. Oh, good get up kick. He's flipped. London and Bellet getting so much use out of this. Okay, nice punish. Battle. Yeah. She punished the shoulder really with the uh, back four forward. Look at these two knowing the punishes of the characters they play. 
Understanding Ooh, the matchup. Chest. Understanding the matchup is the hardest part about playing the character. Incredible. Is when you have to go in for the mirror, you're like, oh shit, what is the what is the punish for that move? I've seen myself do it, but I don't know what to do when I see the other person do it. Yeah. Like every time I fight a Kazuya, it's mm -hmm. it's like, I mean, I, like I know the punishes, but it's but like Kazuya's just seeing terrifying. them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, holy... It's one thing where it's like, okay, I know everything that this guy could be doing in theory, but what is he actually going to do? When you get like hell swept the twenty seventh time, it's like, holy crap. A lot of people are going to be getting exposed in ghost battles against themselves. Yes! Good pickup, by the way. Yeah. Nice wall carry. Oh! Oh, but the spring kick! Like I was saying, London just getting so much mileage out of that spring kick. The spring kicks are abounding. Wow. Winter is over. Puxatani Phil. Oh, she slipped a second says, hit. Spring kicks are coming. They will be in Tekken 8 for sure. Um, oh, yeah, yeah. Ooh. Oh, nice follow-ups, but Holy nice cow. punishment on the shoulder. Very good prescience. Yeah. So that's Bellet uh, looking strong right three now. Three for Bellet. Wow. I think London definitely has it in here to adjust and get at least one game on the board here. Oh, for sure. The question is, when you're down three games in a first to five, how badly does the mental overcome you? That's the question that you have to be asking yourself as a competitor right now. That's like life. Mm-hmm, absolutely. Like, resilience in difficult uh, circumstances. Yeah, it's just, life in general gives you the ability to build up resilience to the mental stack, honestly. And the only way to really just get that tolerance in these kinds of games is just to experience like getting your back blown out, you know. Hmm? Pog says, "I love being down get three games in a first to five Actually, hmm. okay. That's all I have to say to that. <laughs> okay, London now on the left. Yeah, what am I doing? What I am doing isn't working. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's an important thing to, um... Yeah, you definitely have to have a mental reset at some point if you are going down. I think that, um, honestly, uh, to go back to, um, the earlier game against, uh, Me vs. Solar, I definitely saw the mental reset happen oh. after, like, um, game three, where, uh, Solar so was, like, uh... He flipped a switch. Legitimately, like, yeah, the switch, you could tell, like, if you watch back the footage, a switch was flipped. Like, um, different moves were being thrown out, uh different like spacing adjustments were being done like moves that were previously Ooh. getting gotten away with by me were getting uh, punished or uh, checked in some way like speaking of flipping you a could switch. you could see you could see the adjustment getting made yeah speaking of a switch we are seeing london go power gamer mode yeah Ooh, she has nice set up trap there. in her chair mm -hmm. gamer sit the, the, <laughs> the gamer sit Sitting up, hunching slightly forward. Yeah. Hands tightly gripped around a monster energy drink. Bump, bump, bump. All the way to the wall. Mm. Oof. Oh, the hop. The spring kicks are just flowing freely. They're working out great. Mm -hmm. If Mel was watching, she would have an aneurysm because she hates spring kicks. It's That's very interesting. As a... You know, I spring kick. Nice pickup, by the way. This nice is gonna pick kill. Up. This is gonna kill. Yeah, that will kill. Um, London is so good at adjusting. That's it's such a funny like old person position to hate spring kicks. <laughs> Which Mel is not. Because no. It, this is the best spring kicks have ever been. They were so. Mel bad. is a uh, Mel is a lot closer to uh, my age than uh, I believe uh, your age, and I still consider her. Um, a zoomer in a lot of respects just in like um uh you know like just like kind of sort of uh, outlook on things which isn't to be like an insult it's just like a, a mental frame set you know so i don't really i don't know but anyway like spring kicks <laughs> spring kicks used to be so bad 
in man. in old Tekken games, Spring Kick was like the worst get up option. Oh yeah. And yeah, like it, it was um, it was much slower and much more punishable. And in Tekken and Seven, it's like pretty viable a lot of the time. Wow. I never knew that actually. Yeah, this it's um, also the command you had to like roll back slightly. The command was like back three plus four instead of just three plus four. Gotcha. So they, they did tweak the OK system uh, significantly in um, in Tekken Seven. I think it's well, more humane. It looks though. like they're it looks like they're tweaking it again too. Yes. Uh, yes, it is because of her love of Sonic the Hedgehog. That is correct. Yeah, but like in Tag Two or Tekken Six, spring kicking would like almost always get you killed. Oh really? I never yeah. knew that. I never really. Uh, paid attention to this game before uh, 7. Mm -hmm. And even then, it wasn't really until, like, uh, Season 2, I think. We're, we're super glad everybody's uh, playing Tekken now. It's it's beautiful. Yeah. It's been, um, I want to say about uh, 18 months since I picked the game up, and I'm having a blast. That's wonderful. Oh, yeah. Oh. Here comes Bella. Very nice, uh, yeah, very nice pickup by Bella there, by the way. Uh, yes, Asuka has an Oki charge, I'm aware. You made it- you made it abundantly clear the last Ooh. time we played. Dancing at range. Nice. Oh, gotta punish that, gotta punish that. Spacing? Ooh. Oh my gosh! Mm. AOP! <laughs> AOP slipped the while standing four. Ridiculous. What? what a funny move. Nice pickup. She needs a conversion to the wall. Okay. Nice wall ender. I was not sure if Bellet would get that wall ender, but oh, no, very admirable out. adjustment. Oh, this is the London. Um... I think London. I think what you need to do after this set is to go in lab your lab your basic bread and butter combos against this character. If you're like me, you probably lab ninety percent of your combos in training mode against Tehachi, just because he's the default player to select Ooh. option. Wow. But going in, labbing against female and male characters will give you so much more consistency. It's pretty important. Mm -hmm. Wow. Nice. This is great pickup. Yeah, London's swinging. Oh, did not get the uh, balcony break for some reason. Probably hit it in an angle or something. X marks the spot. Is it safe? Oh no! Alright. Two to three, it's a lot closer than it looked. Yeah. Hashtag London Sweep. London Sweep. Maybe. I mean, maybe we'll just see a, a close set here. Maybe. Maybe. I definitely think this is going to double Luigi. If I had uh, channel points to bet, I would bet Whoa. that this goes to 4-4. Four, four. You know, I don't have channel points. Are you um, affiliate? I could be. I just got the offer, actually. Oh, so really? Nice. Shout outs to everybody for uh, you know tuning into the stream. Oh, yeah. Uh, I, I, I absolutely wouldn't have it if it wasn't for people watching KG events. Nobody watches my stream except kin <laughs> Kindergarten people. Well, oh. and, and a few other people, but mostly like IRL friends who like gotcha. know me personally and like me and my and IRL friends people. are probably like mostly like the last people that would watch my streams because oh. <laughs> they're like I see you enough in real life why would I want to watch you on the computer too oh, oh man I agree, uh, Zero. I think you made a very good point there. It's true. Um, when you said uh, Pikachu, 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 wow. Pikachu, Pikachu, dog, 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 dog. Heck yeah. Agreed. Yeah, no, Spitting. I completely agree with that. Your IRL friends are very different from you. I think that, um, I think that you could say the same about everybody, honestly, to some extent. Like, you don't make friends with people who are exactly the same as you. Nice pickup. Wow, okay. Shoulder Ooh. punishes the shoulder. Shoulder to shoulder. Fist to fist, shoulder to shoulder. Heartache to heartache. Yeah. 
Ooh, good punish. Well, not a great punish, but a good punish, we'll call it. Round two. Fight. Ooh, 421. Ooh, strong round start. Good pickup from uh, Bell there. Wow. Not all the way oh to the goodness. wall, but pretty close and jumps over the getup option. <laughs> AOP ducks underneath the uh, mid option. She needs it. Absolutely. The AOP duck is so funny because, like, you go from being, like, able to duck, like, some mids to being able to duck some lows, I swear to God. <laughs> it's, like, right under the stature kick. It's crazy. It's like, it, for anybody here who knows Guilty Gear, it's, I swear to God, it's got, like, soul... 2D properties. It's crazy. Oof. It's so low profile. Oh. Oh. Nice. She to the could. wall. And the conversion. All right. That's nice a lot of damage. Combo. Great Oki, too. Very strong showing from uh, Bellet here. Definitely wants this game. You can feel you can feel the desire to clench Oof. this. Oh, no. Nice. So I'm seeing... <laughs> we were having a conversation about this. And this is terrible. I'm, I'm going to... I think that Bellet thinks that down forward T1 is more punishable than it is. Oh, yeah? The down forward T1 is her uh, the uppercut, the upwards, the, upwards yeah. fan, right? Yeah. Yep, the swingity swing. How, how minus is that? I don't actually know. I think it's 12 or 13, and I think she thinks it's worse than that. Okay. Well, I mean, there's why. Oh. Kick? Or no, spring kick. Those are two different things. Oof. <laughs> We're just seeing some swinging. Ridiculous. It's all tied and up. It's three nice to three. slow from London. Yeah, three to three. I told you, we're going to see some games here. The, the most final Luigi. We're going down to the wire. And I don't mean the critically acclaimed television show. Who was the actor who... Mm -hmm. A lot of famous actors were on that. Oh, um, yeah, a lot of famous actors, yeah. The, um... What's the guy's name? Lance Riddick. Lance Riddick? Yeah, Riddick, he was yeah. the, uh... He was the, uh, police lieutenant. Yeah. Very, uh, very, very strong role for him, by the way. One of his, uh... One of my favorite roles of his. Yeah. And yeah uh, and like, and... Uh, like Solar said, rest in peace. Definitely uh, going yeah. too soon. He was so Man. funny on the Eric Andre show. <laughs> I believe that. He's got that kind of like demeanor where you would think that he does not have a sense of humor at all, but like you put him on a comedy show and he just gets everybody to just laugh directly from the gut. It's very impressive. It was incredible. Mm -hmm. Anybody who hasn't seen his appearance on uh, the Eric Andre show and uh, is a fan of Lance Reddick, definitely check that out. Okay, London now on the right. Mm -hmm. So I think that was going uh, to infinite three O both ways, wow. wasn't it? Uh, yeah, London now has three in a yeah. row. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yep. Well, I told you, it's uh, the it's the start of the London sweep. Uh, Ballot got uh, three games, and then uh, London got three games. They're just uh, we're watching um, a blatant case of win trading here for uh, for ranked points. Wow. Ooh, good follow up. I feel like there's got to be a better punish for the uh, down, down forward two one than just uh, throwing out a low. I, I think it's the shoulder. Mm -hmm. Would I go on the Eric Andre show? No, I'm not nearly funny enough to go on the Eric Andre show. Round two. Wow. Fight. Okay, London now taking Ooh. the lead in the set. Uh, three, Absolutely. Three games in one round. Nice. I'm seeing a lot of uh, throw attempts coming out this round. Safe power crush. She needs it. Ooh, she that does. was a whiff punish. Nice pickup. Adjusting the combo. Nope. Ooh. Ooh, tries to throw him off. Does not work. Oh my goodness. Oh, so Shumi! Oh, uh -oh. it doesn't hold down. Uh -oh. This is gonna kill. Uh oh. London's so good with that combo. Wow. 
Right. I feel like, honestly, I feel like when London learned Xiaoyi, that was like the first combo that she learned because it just, it looks so sick and I don't blame her. <gasps> it's such a cool combo. I always learn, I always learn the flashy stuff first, so I can definitely relate. That turned into the down kick. Mm -hmm. Very strong low usage so far from uh, both players here this round. We're definitely seeing a lot of ankles getting clipped. Oh, this is very, very dangerous. Somebody's gonna rage drive. Perhaps both. I am. I am definitely feeling a rage drive coming out in the next five seconds. There it is. Okay, that'll do yes. it. Wow. <laughs> we just saw both. <gasps> I don't know if you saw that, but both players activated rage drive. Yes. Uh, oh, certified, certified shall you moment. London taking the lead. Hog says they are literally practicing counter hit forward four while standing four and the hundred dollar combo on Jin for that exact reason. Yeah. You gotta do the flashy stuff. If you don't impress people when you play, why are you playing? Well, there's a lot of reasons why, actually. Staring a single brain cell. That's very correct, yeah. That's why they're win trading. They're just popping the brain cell into each other's head between games, you know? Wow. The Zhao Yu brain cell. So this is actually set point now for London. Yes. With Valid has to be very careful about uh, the approach on uh, this next set of games here. Potentially one game. Potentially two. It all depends on how the dice roll. And by dice, I mean skill. And yeah. by skill, I mean Xiaoyu is a coin flip character. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Uh, all... Bell, it needs to just whiff punish. Yeah, I mean, honestly, both characters are definitely getting away with more than they should. But I mean, that's just the nature of playing against your own character. You feel like you know way more about them than you actually do, and you get overconfident in your uh, in your pickups and your reads and stuff like that. Hmm. Okay, Ooh. strong start from uh, oh, London, but London Bell, it immediately the... answers back. Left. We're seeing a uh, default Daniel come out from uh, London here. Oh no, that's Bellet. Oh, yeah, no, you're right. I was reading it wrong. Yeah, the, I, nice. I swapped the squares. Okay, gotcha. Fight. Wow. I was gonna say, I don't think I've ever seen London actually use Jai's default costume. Heck of a whiff punish there. Yeah, definitely. There's another one. Whiff punish shoulder. Hope Kiku. Okay. Very good hop kick. Oh, she falls out. She's too little. Yep. Oh. This is why we. This is why you gotta practice your combos against female characters, guys. Yeah. Oh, oh. Uh, wall. Oh, there's the not drive. quite. Not quite there. Oh. Oh, good duck. Very strong rolling duck. The Bella needs to be very careful wow. here. And she is. Good. Good mid check there. Side step four. Ooh, Good pickup. Big round start sweep. London loves throwing out the uh, side step sweep at the round start because it's, it gets such good results. It's really good. Mm -hmm, and the side absolutely. step four, it's it's pretty low commitment. Like yeah, if, no, I agree. Uh, I think it's a big pop up. Like unseeable okay. counter hit low. That's relatively safe. Like that's so good. Yeah. Cut, they, it's nice good job uh, punishing the spring kick there. They give me one too. <laughs> they, they ought not have given me that, but they did. <laughs> oh, Second very hit. nice movement. <gasps> Punch parry. Oh, we love to see it. Wow. Unfortunately, not quite able to uh, get the flash there. Okay. London here on set point. Yep. London definitely feeling herself at the moment. Wow. Definitely playing a lot more confidently than she was four games ago. There's a snake edge there a second ago. Mm -hmm. Running okay. three. Ballot saying not out of the game yet. Definitely wants to stay in. Although, she got to win this round. Mm -hmm. Oh, Let's no. See what the interaction is. Oh, the rage drive, rage drive takes it. it. Such a good rage drive. Honestly, in my estimate, definitely one of the top five rage drives in the game. It's quite good. It is, the threat of it by itself is enough to deter a lot of people it's, from blocking mid. It's huge. Mm-hmm. 
the huge internet. with a capital Y. Yeah. Very, very strong. Nice work, London. Nice work, Bella. Nice work, that was Nice work, Bella, yeah. Great set. Both of you played really well. It's just London was able to adapt faster. It's really that simple. Yeah. Some days, some days you're the adapter, and some days you're the one adapting, you know? It's just really that simple. That made more sense before I said it out loud, but you get what I'm trying to say. That's, uh... That's the kind of wisdom that you can only get by tuning in to violent systems from your gym. Smash that bell. Hit that. <laughs> like Ring that subscription bar. Absolutely. And give me five dollars, please. Wow. I need gas money. Heck yeah. Tip your tip your servers. Um <laughs> so we got one more set. Um follow on Mastodon. We got follow one. on. We got one more set, and I think it's me uh, against lunch. If lunch is ready, lunch, are you are you around? I'm gonna have to take another. I quick... saw lunch. Uh, I saw lunch boot up Tekken Seven. Yes, so. lunch is there. I'll be right back. Give me one second. I'm gonna okay. um, mute myself again. Uh, I have to remember to mute myself in two places. Bell, it says they do the opposite of adjust in all of their first to fives. They play well in the first few games and then become a potato. I get that. I'm kind of the same way where I show off my bag of tricks in the first few games that I play. And then it's like, okay, the bag's empty. Um, now I just have like a sack that's empty. And what do I do with this? You know? Lunch, you have a headache. Already taken the upper limit of ibuprofen. Um, are you going to be okay to play? Do you need to uh, duck? Just, uh, you know, don't push yourself. Uh, if you're not feeling well, uh, there's no pressure on you to play. But um, we do want to see some games if you do think it is feasible. Problem is you can't find people to play first to tens with you. Yeah, that's... People don't in typically enjoy... Uh, playing longer sets. Because, you know, because of the reasons that get outlined where it's like, okay, I showed off everything I can do in the first five games. Might as well call it here while I'm still, you know, riding high on a win or whatever. Or, you know, people do get physically and mentally fatigued. I used to be able to go, like, 50 60 games in like one session and then i uh stopped playing for about a year or so i want to say that was when i first got my current job and i was just feeling really down and out about my uh fighting games performance oh and then um i got back into the swing of things and i was like i play 10 games and i just feel mentally winded it's like it's, it's like you can't even see straight. Like, you're watching your character move around, and you're, like, not even comprehending that you're the one that's controlling them. It gets to that point. Oof. It's all about building up your mental stamina. It's really what it is. It's, like, being able to track what's on screen, knowing your upper limits, and working around them. Because, like, you can't force yourself to play better or concentrate more. It's something that you just have to naturally build up. And you can't push yourself to get to that level before you're actually ready to, because you'll just end up burning yourself out faster. This is important wisdom. Mm -hmm. So we got uh, we got lunch. Lunch is in here. Uh, I don't think lunch is in the chat, or I haven't seen them saying anything. Uh, but shout outs to lunch. Is there a character out, that anybody wants to see? I need to set myself to not be auto skipping. Uh, Pog, yeah, feel free to hop on commentary. Um, I'm gonna have to. Yeah, you... honestly, Bellet, I think that that is in a form of <clears throat> stamina because, like, you can play forever tech on a like a technical level until like your fingers fall off or whatever. But eventually, you're gonna realize that you're not running at peak performance. Yeah. So I'm gonna mute also, myself. Also, what's up, Pog? How's it going? Is Pog in the? Hey, hi. Hello, Pog. Yeah, I'm here. Hi, hi. And Paul Hello. is in the chat. Okay, I'm muting myself. Y'all, okay. tell me, Good luck, tell me what character to play. Uh, Kazuya. Jack. Jack. I switch my answer to Jack. But you have to play. Uh, you have to play P Jack. 
Yeah, and you have to do the one every time. Yeah, you have to do one every time. We call that, uh... Well, p -Jack's not even in this game. That's fucked up. We call that, uh, the lies of p -Jack. Okay, very interesting alternate Jack costume that we're seeing here. <laughs> I'm not familiar with this costume for Jack. Yeah, he's... He's in the chat hyping up his uh, one skill. <laughs> We're going to see a lot of plant the seeds. Absolutely. Well, it debug. says in the first two games, Whiff punished things and played well. And in the last few games, he just threw random shit out. Yeah, honestly, like, yeah. I mean, it's just like, that's just the mental stack. You know, you, you're on top of things and then you play a couple of games and you just get to that point where you can't keep up with what's happening and shall you is especially hard to yeah, deal yeah, with yeah. in that regard i absolutely agree with you once We're you start worrying you. about like oh never mind <laughs> just immediately sidetracked by whatever's going on on screen right now classic mishima battle here <laughs> that's true we're watching two mishimas Okay, nice duck. Very good, um, very good presence of mind already from Alex here. Oh my god. <laughs> Exposing the gaps in the matchup knowledge here just immediately. You gotta save that shit for, um, for game four. Round three. Fight. All right. Go ace. Hey. Oh, good block punish into launch. Shining Wizard. What's the play afterwards? The play is block the up kick. The safe mid poke, you can't punish it. <laughs> it is a safe mid poke, that's so true. Alright. Alex Eight takes the points. first win with Jack. Yeah, very strong showing so far from uh, Jag. I guess Jag, because Jaguar, you know? I think Jag uh, means something else. Oh wait, did you? Yeah, yeah. Like I call people Jags all the time. Sorry. Oh. I'm a very rude it, person. I know that it's uh, I know that it's an engineer unlock in Team Fortress too. That's true. It's like the best unlock for engineer in my opinion. Yeah, which is weird because like uh, seven years ago it was the worst because they did the math wrong on the build speed for it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Armor but Jack, even yeah. still. No yeah, one has yeah. gotten to the point of switching to engineer, repairing your shit, then switching off when they respawn. <laughs> you'd think it would. You'd think people would know by this point. The game is over a decade old. You'd think people would figure it out by now. That if you see a level one teleporter when you step out of spawn, you fix it up. Come on, people. It's older than the entire player base of Fortnite. Like that's let's get what real. I'm saying. Okay, we got a costume change. Hey, okay, lunch has see, the cowboys. Let's see if the desperado can bring order to this lawless town. Yo, the key charge. The real setup on. Yes, Arlington. that's crazy. I have never seen that before. That's insanely cool. Oh, Hurricane man. is sick. He is so sick. <laughs> Alex is gonna make me become. An AK player before the night's over. I can, I, mean, I can feel it. He's got dark upper, right? Yeah, he's got dark upper. What else do you need? Okay. Ooh, nice good hop, hop kick. kick. I think Alex has definitely picked up on the fact that Lunch loves to do the two in a row lows there. Especially because it high crushes. Mm -hmm. The hop kick is just such a sensible way to deal with that. It, yeah, it, no, it makes sense. Good roll. Mm -hmm. Nice. Okay. Catching so many launches with that hop kick so far. We're not even two games in, and we've seen almost a double digit number of hop kicks here. Adding to the list rapidly. To the wall. Going for the record. Oh, good combo. Gets tagged by the wake up. Does not seem phased by it. Oh, Moon the stop. unblockable setup. I don't know if that's true for Armor King, but for King, you want to roll forward to get out of that. Uh, I 
think AKs is the same way. It looks like the same animation, but I don't know if it's got the same hitboxes on it or not. It's it's similar, you know but it's is. worse. Uh, Honestly, I never see Armor King, so... Yeah. It's like, what if King didn't have RDC? Does he have RDC? I don't even know. I, I but that was just way harder. I don't know. Because you never see him. If only Possessed Merc was here to drop the knowledge. Does Possessed Merc even know anything about AK? I don't know. I mean, he knows a lot about King, so you'd have to know at least a little bit about AK, right? Uh, yeah. Alex is muted, yes. He said he's going to be muted while he plays his sets. The AK does not have RDC. Thank you, Incomplete Stone. Okay, that's what I thought. It does have Shining Wizard, though. That's yes. really all you need. That is the coolest, though. Oh. Oh my god. Oh. Oh. We need a moment. Okay. Wow, Mutt? I think we, uh, I think we're seeing a DC, maybe? Or not a DC, but, uh, like a controller disconnect? Some kind yeah, of it, it looks like the controller got disconnected yeah. while holding a back input. All inputs Oh my god, reversed. Neko Arc got him. Uh. He got hit by the funny gas that Faust throws out. I swear... I don't know why uh, no can... other game does this, but when I played Street Fighter uh, 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 6, my let's... controls were fucked up every time I opened the game. I never had it work properly. That but... happens to me too. The controller setup in Street Fighter 6 is cursed. I think I told this story before. Um, I don't think it was uh, on commentary, but... Uh, so I went to like a local, and it was like the first uh, two weeks that... Okay, um... ready? Oh, hey, okay. here you are. Hey, we're ready. I think okay, okay, so yeah, we'll just uh, we'll just cancel this game and then. Perfect. Yeah, that seems that seems fair. Yeah. But right. um, so I went to a local for uh, Street Fighter Six, and it was like the it was new because it was like oh everybody's playing this game I might as well enter it because it's fun and everybody's playing it, and so I play my first game, the I don't check the controls because I'm like oh it's Street Fighter everybody's using the same default loadout. And uh, I have the most fucked up control scheme that I have ever played on a fighting game. Like Ooh. my punch, not only not only were my punches and kicks reversed, but also like the light and heavy strengths were also reversed. That's so nuts. like punches were on the bottom row, kicks were on the top row, heavy was on the left side, and uh, light was on the right <laughs> side. I'm like, what fresh hell is this? Oh my god. You got yeah. the Australian player stick. I did uh, got the Australian player stick. So uh, I go in, I, I like I take my loss, because that's on me. I'm like, I'm not gonna contest that, because that's that's my fault for not checking. So I, I lose game one, which I mean the guy was a lot better than me too, so I would have I would have lost it anyways, if I'm being completely honest. But I go in to the um I, I say to him like hold on a second, I need to change my buttons. So I check my controls and um I input everything again the way that it should be and i pick my character and i go in and it's still wrong like it's less wrong but it's still wrong that's and really I'm like, unfortunate how does this happen <laughs> and i mean like i said like i said um i didn't hold it against the guy because like he was <clears throat> absolutely like a way better player than me but like it just it felt it felt bad losing to something that is not actually a part of the game yeah i mixed i mixed myself up twice that's and that's that's really like unfortunate feels bad <laughs> it does feel well, bad. i was doing this on cami and with cami your standing like kick is your just neutral foot c button mm -hmm. my controls got messed up so i'm doing standing medium kick which you can't combo off yeah so i'm doing standing a medium kick into completely face spiral <laughs> 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 I swear they like nerfed that button into the ground because of the absolute war crimes that it committed in Street Fighter V. 
Yeah. I don't know, I didn't really like the game very much, and all the characters they tried were fun. Free Fire 6, yeah. yeah. It's um, too reliant on Drive Rush. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I think that the Drive Rush meta is definitely real. Which, you know, if you like that sort of thing, there's, you know, it's, it's a great game. Even with, uh, even mm -hmm. with like, the minor issues that it currently has, but I think, uh, like Street Fighter V, it's gonna be the best it's gonna get here in, like, two, two, two plus years or so. It's gotta, it's gotta have time to marinate in the oven, is what I'm saying. It needs Akuma. Mm-hmm. It does need Akuma. Absolutely. I'll say this. It started way better than Street Fighter V did. No, absolutely, yeah. It's, <clears throat> it's lowest point is like about on par with Street Fighter V's highest point, in my opinion. Wow. And to, to me, Street Fighter VI is similar to Dragon Ball Fighter Z, which is, it's a good game. It's just not for me. Mm -hmm. I can understand that, yeah. There's a lot of people... So this, this issue that I have with how people talk about Street Fighter is that they assume that it's default fighting games. Like... Every other fighting game is just a permutation of Street Fighter, which, yeah, 20 years ago, that was true. But ah, lunch is back. it's 100% not anymore. It's so I think people need to, like, shake that misconception in the modern, also, in the modern day. There's this misconception that Street Fighter 2 is, like, this honest, neutral game that everyone's <laughs> playing. Street Fighter 2 is well, so I degenerate. <laughs> Uh, it's always been oh, degenerate. Okay, I'm muted. I have, uh, okay, so, see you later. But y'all gotta understand, I am facing off against the coach. And I there, believe there's it, yeah. a reason why they're, why they're the coach. Yeah, yeah. This is no, the that's coach absolutely true. With a functional controller. This is Coach Z right here. Coach Z has got to be like top five home star characters. <laughs> it's not even close. He's in my top three easily. Top three? Top three, easily. I mean, you gotta put Homsar there, right? Yeah, Homsar, Homsar, Coach Z, and uh, Bubs, probably. Bubs? Yeah. Good choice. Yeah. Let us know what, uh, let us know what your top five uh, Homestar winner characters are in the comments below. Yeah, tweet Ooh, hashtag nice Violent note. Systems Homestar. <laughs> yeah, yeah, hashtag Violent Systems Homestar. Let the people know. Vote now on your phones. Ooh, the nice. Lead. That does so much damage on it. Really it really does. It's crazy. It's like a mini combo by itself. It's like that Leroy down forward three plus four he's got in um, Tekken Eight, where it just does like the damage of a combo in the cinematic. To me, it looks like this is the advice everyone uses against Lunch, but he's using it against Alex now. Yeah. You know, well, like that's, he's... Why, that's why he's the coach. Oh, nice. exactly. That hits the wall. Not mm. quite. But against lunch, he's always going to be low parrying. So yeah, mids are lunch, a lot better. Lunch is literally always buffering a low parry. It seems like. So we're seeing a lot more mids being thrown out, and oh. it's going pretty well. No break on that. It's pretty hard to break, to be honest. Yeah, especially when it comes out that quickly. If someone's like running at you full screen, you're probably going to react every time. Yeah. But you really yeah. got to lab it. You do. The instant while running is definitely tricky to break. You Ooh, have nice. to like know that it's coming. Good float combo. Ooh, good spacing from Alex. Which is one too many jabs to get the full ender. Ooh. Nice. Showing off the matchup knowledge here. Uh -huh. Another shining wizard. We love to shine. Good break. Good break. Getting lots of use out of that sweep. Okay. Doing a good job of um, punishing the unsafe moves here. Alex, one of the only people in the uh, KG roster that uh, really consistently makes uh, lunch pay for an obvious mistake. Yeah, I mostly just get counter hit and die. Yeah, same. I don't know Lars that well. So it's like, if you're not very familiar with the character, it's very easy to just see everything that he's doing and just go like, well, obviously that's safe. It looks safe. But then you remember that you're fighting against Lars and it's probably launch punishable. Also, a uh, nice comeback from Alex there. Fight. 
Oh, very good. Gets the combo. Shining Wizard. Or no, that's the uh, pickup slam. I don't remember what that one's called. I just call it the pickup, honestly. Yeah, I just oh call gosh. it the pickup. Okay. Good break. break. Ooh. Ooh. Just noticing every single instant that he's going to be sweeping. Doing such a good job of calling out the uh, misplaced lows there. Yep. One good low poke finishes off, but that was a good adjustment. Absolutely, yeah. Alex goes up to uh, 3-0. Is Lunch going to stick it out with the Lars, or is he going to switch to Claudio or Chloe? I don't know. That's a good question. I think we usually see Lunch either go to one of those two whenever they are down a set, a point in a set. So. But Lunch has also been sticking it out. That is true, yeah. I thought we would see a switch in um, Bellet versus uh, London. So we are really just in a night full of surprises here. No, no, no. Those two are going to rep Link Nation till the end. <laughs> you got to respect that level of character loyalty. Ling Nation is ride or die. Yep, we are seeing a Chloe. And there Chloe confirmed. White woman spotted. So how scary do you feel that Launch's Chloe is compared to the Lars? It's a bit hard to say. They're different characters entirely. I uh, agree with you on that point. I think one thing that Ooh, Launch does nice really well. switch up to get to the wall. Very smart. Sorry, go ahead. I think one thing Launch does very well is rotate his characters based around uh, what his opponent is doing. Yeah, yeah. Bear in mind that Lunch does use any pronouns. Mm, I will gotcha. interchangeably swap it to force a gender mix up on the audience. <laughs> pronouns free for all. Oh, doesn't do the Cali roll. I have to assume Lunch is just under the assumption that Alex is going to OS the Cali roll. It, yeah, which is a safe assumption but not always a correct one mm -hmm. good oh but boss, uh, so close showing just a little bit of rust maybe on the chloe matchup here on alex's side maybe has not labbed it recently or maybe just not labbed it recently as ak Chloe is a terrifying matchup because you block yes. one thing you're good you miss the second block in your half health mm-hmm now you're at the wall, and now you have just terrible misses to you're deal You're at with. the wall, you're regretting all of your life choices that got you to this point. Good movement options there from Alex. And there it is. Chloe is just such a character to make you second guess yourself at every possible turn. Not going for the extensions on the string there. That is a very smart option to just show off the move without attaching the string to it. It keeps them on their toes, you know. Ooh, there we go. That's the OS. Good flow. Mm -hmm. Kick. Kick. Very close to uh, there. Yep. And the jab to steal the round. Good job. Mm -hmm. All right, lunch on the board. <laughs> Welcome Danny back to Danny. Back playing a certified bad character. Yeah, everyone told Alex to play Jack, so he picked yeah. Armor King. Still I, was... I Same character. Look. <laughs> Lunch is doing great, and that is why they're the coach. Uh -huh. And Armor King rules. Armor, Armor King, King is rule. one of the best characters. He does not have RDC. And he does not and, have RDC. And he does you have an option select, first. and I know it. So <laughs> <laughs> that's the spirit. Get ready for the next battle. <laughs> the Armor King haters in the chat. Wow. Who would have thought shooters in chat? 
The other thing to keep in mind is this is two cats fighting each other. That is true. This is the battle of the kings of the jungle. The jaguar and the uh, uh, discord kitten. Yeah. Yeah. Bella did play AK for quite a bit. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I was there for the AK arc. I don't think I was around for the AK arc. Nice. Oh, the <laughs> rolls! <laughs> Chloe's saying, I've got a Weibu too. Gotta keep them guessing. Oh my god. Ooh. I think that might be, like, the best option there, too. I don't know. I just don't know enough about this matchup from either side to really say for sure. Well, just because you get the whole string off guaranteed. Mm, that would make sense, yeah. Ooh, good movement. Nice step. <laughs> nice. That's a big launcher. Gonna go to the wall. Yep. To the wall. And gets a whole wall combo, too. Very nice. On Souk, no less. Yeah, On that's, the sidewall. That's, that's hard to do. That's hard to do. Alex showing off some great movement here. Round three. Fight. Nice jab Eight float. Low. Not sure what was coming out to warn a float. Ooh, big throw. Nice throw. throw. <laughs> Just trading counter hits. But this one does a lot more. Uh-huh. Doesn't quite get the full end. Uh -oh. But, oh, there you go. Uh-oh. We're seeing a non some string cheese. Slot. Nice sweep to close it. Round four. Lunch on the board. Fight. Oh does my not god. Get, does not want to get low, no round brown. Oh. Nice, good spacing. Doing a good job of uh, keeping Chloe guessing on the uh, wake up op options there. One thing Lunch does very well is Lunch gets them low and then resorts only to pokes after that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, does not over, does not overcommit, doesn't throw out like uh, risky sweeps or anything. Jumping the low into the launcher just mm. no very, hesitation. Yeah, very very Lunch style of play. Nice job with the OS. Throwing out just low after low. That's what Chloe's known for. It's just aggravating you. And then as soon as you drop your guard. Yep. Make you make oh a mistake. God. It's just such a classic way to play. And Chloe does it so well. Just give you just enough rope to hang yourself with. Alex taking another round here. Mm -hmm. Alex wanting to close this out. He says, we've been streaming for two and a half hours. I want to go. I got stuff to do. That's what he's saying. Alex is just pissed that people are hating on AK. <laughs> That's actually probably why. AK is one of the coolest characters. Armor King game, is I... like top one fantastic. Like I, I'm <laughs> almost an Armor King. I, I, if I didn't love Kazuya so much and Feng and Kazumi, I would 100% <laughs> only play Armor King. Absolutely. I, I completely, the I completely understand where you're coming from. What about Anna? Anna's great what too. About I, Anna? I do love what Anna. What about Anna? What about Anna? If I, okay, if I lose, I'm switching to Anna. <laughs> Anna's up next. Promise. <laughs> it's almost like he's not good. Damn. Certified haters in the chat. He is he is a lot worse than he should be though. I completely agree. They need to give my boy buffs in Tekken 8. They need to get your boy in Tekken 8 to begin with. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He's absolutely gonna be DLC. I don't think he'll be season one DLC, but I could definitely see him being season two DLC. Great patience there and rewarded fully. Doesn't quite get the ender. Mm -hmm. Good throw. That's the uh, mix up to uh, Giant Swing, I believe. The headbutts. Mm -hmm. It's got a similar. It's got a similar looking throw. The Skull Crusher. Very smart use of the tumbling attack. 
just to slip below. Yeah, it's uh, very good at um, just dealing with Chloe's specific brand of bullshit. Good carry. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta keep him guessing. Oh, we're nice seeing some step. sidewalk shenanigans. Good roll, though. Good roll. Very smart. Oh! No, oh! That not hit. Oh. <laughs> I got what he was trying to do. I don't think he was expecting Chloe to keep going. That's unfortunate. Listen, Chloe is the master spinner. Yeah. I love that this just keeps going if it's off access. <laughs> it's crazy. That move is so ridiculous. The same thing happens whenever I play Dragonov and I'm yeah. off axis. Like, I just go flying past with all running, too. I mean, they can't even when, punish me. When, I mean, you saw me play uh, versus Zafina earlier. Like, we were just swapping places, like, left and right. Just trading spaces, swooping around. Set point for Alex. Now, Danny, I don't disagree that this character is not the greatest, but any other <laughs> characters, any other characters, Rage Art would have also whiffed in that situation. Which is all the way to the wall. Yeah. But Alex fights back. Oh. He is determined to show everyone the power of Armor King. He says, if JDCR can do it, I can do it. Nice run up. Oh, okay. very smart kick. Oh my oh, god. I, does, Joe's under the rage drive. Wanted to get the rage drive into the untackable. Oh man. Oh my god. This is, this one, this one's going in the books. This roll pressure is absolutely suffocating. Nice. Okay, let's see. Okay. Ooh, nice. Big counter hit. What's the play at the wall? Oh, fights back. Just keep hitting him with the knee. Determined, but takes it. That is the game. Getting so much use out of those launching mids there. A good game. Look, yeah. It's not a regular streamer. Yeah. Lunch, you play great. That's why you're the coach. Armor King freaking rules. Armor King is Armor the greatest King character. Is, Armor King is uncoachable. Top one. Top one character. Top one. Unbeatable. No bad matchups. Not a one. Especially Lunch, not the one great. that we just watched. You played real good. You d you kept doing you kept doing jab in a down four, and I kept not low parrying it, and I I I should have. It was like oh jabs and then like low poke. And kept happening. I didn't handle it. Okay. Um, internet, thank you so much. Thank you so much for coming through. Another Kinder Gym in the books. Kinder Gym Violent Systems. Happy Another Big Another Violent Systems. Not a Kinder Gym. Big shout outs or shouts out if you're Mel to Pog and Mint for co commentating. I, I really appreciate uh, We had a beautiful fight card today. We had. I'm going to. Uh, stop streaming to the Discord. We had Solar versus Mint. Uh, Mint taking it in convincing fashion, although Solar played great. It was close. Uh, we had Pog versus Warbane. Pog with incredible uh, staggered pressure, uh, looking really strong. Uh, we had Bellet versus Yeah, yeah I was a cheater. <laughs> you played great. You used the, you used the forbidden moves. You, for, you used the forbidden move of staggered jab pressure. Incredible. It was, you played great. It was, it was really good. Uh, we had uh, Danny, man of many names, taking on Zero. Uh, we had Very Bell exciting match, that one. Ling Nation, Internecine Conflict. Uh, really, that was that was a fantastic set. And then- uh, You hate to see Ling on Ling violence, but we love to watch that match. <laughs> yeah. And then, uh, 
Me versus lunch, and nice work lunch. That was, uh, you know, that, that was great. Um, AK number one. He's, yeah. What are you gonna do against a muscular Jaguarman? Probably get thrown and die. You're gonna get thrown and die, yeah. All right. I'm gonna call the stream. I'm gonna whiff a button and get dark hoppered. That's um. If I could, uh, if I could take over for just a second. Yeah. So I'm going to be um, running an interest form on the Kinder Gym uh, Discord for anybody who uh, regularly competes in violent systems. I'm going to be uh, whipping that up this weekend, and basically, I just want to get a quick interest check of what day of the week works for everybody for running violent systems. If we want to just keep it on Fridays at the regular time, that's fine too. Uh, but if anybody wants to change it up, now is the time to. Uh, well, I say now, but once I publish that, it'll be the time to uh, let your voice get known. And so, starting uh, next week, I'm going to be uh, helping Alex uh, run the uh violent system stream so we're probably going to be uh in some fashion uh alternating between uh the two of our streams so mm -hmm. just thanks so much for keep an that. eye out yeah keep an eye out for uh any changes to that and uh we will try and make things uh clear and apparent before they happen just so there's no confusion on anybody's end oh, i gotta give myself that five there we go set the score to five <laughs> Beautiful. Okay. Internet, thank you so much for coming through. Uh, it's been a pleasure. Uh, another beautiful Big Friday. And uh, see you all next time. All right. Thanks so much for tuning in. Yay. Have Bye. Fun. Bye. Bye.